What's amazing is how peaceful that water's just left to lie. Just how peaceful it is. Both the pond that we're adding this addition on and this addition. It's extremely peaceful. But as soon as we break through this clay dam, man, it's amazing the amount of force and the amount of power that you're dealing with. It's truly incredible. Oh, there goes a largemouth bass. <laughs> nice. That is awesome. Truly incredible. Hell yeah, man. Now we're moving water. <laughs> Sweet. Woo! Love it. Love it, just love it. Starting to notice the water level dropping in the mother pond over here.
<laughs> I love it, man. Man, what a rush. I love that. I never get tired of that. Look at that. Just look at that. Just insane. <laughs> yeah, baby. Man, is that awesome. Oh, that is too cool. Look at this guy, he just, he doesn't stop. Oh, she's starting to settle down a bit now, that's for sure. Man. I knew that this, this pond that we were adding this addition to I knew it was a big pond and I, and I know it's deep because my buddy he dug it and good friend of mine uh, back I believe in 2005 he dug this original piece and it's deep I know that because they needed the dirt it was a borrowing pit back then Woo! man oh man Man, that was too cool. I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. I can't top that. Man, that is awesome. That is truly amazing. So I guess the beach is going to be down there. A bunch of sand is going to get dumped there in the spring. Pavilion put up on top of the, the area we built up with some picnic tables. It's going to be really, really nice. Now we can dredge it. You know, we dropped it enough to dredge it. So we'll, we'll go along the edges all the way around this pond. Take this opportunity now to dredge it. Damn. Man, was that fun. Very cool. absolutely incredible that's how you fill a pond <laughs> you can see the equipment's big that we're using look at Francisco's next to the bucket of that hydraulic shovel you got Marcelo standing up on the bulldozer working the hydraulic blade yeah big toys but you know what they work no different than the little ones the rules are the same so if you can rent a small one and run it DIY, you can have one of these delivered to your property and dig yourself a pond. Well, there's the property owner right there. Awesome. Incredible. Alright guys, I don't know how I'm going to top that this week, but until the next video. All right, to give you an idea, this was a really big pond. This is, you know, this this is like very close to a man-made lake here. Uh, this was for the kayak. When you'd go down and get in the kayak, this was in the water. Well, after the drought, the water was here. So when we broke that dam, and yeah, I walked around it and threw some fish back in that forgot apparently how to swim because, I don't know, if the water was sucking me out this way, I, I think I'd just go.
go with the path of least resistance. That's kind of how I am in life in general. Ask my wife. So why they would stay in the weeds and just let the water beneath them disappear is beyond me. But just want everybody to know I saved every single... It was, it was the bluegill that were the, the ones that weren't too sharp. But we need something for the largemouth bass to feed on. 